click the bell icon to get latest videos from ekida hello friends now we'll discuss the concept of return on proprietors fund in ratio analysis who are called as proprietors in case of company in case of company proprietors means shareholders of the company shareholders means equity shareholders and preference shareholders of the company equity shareholders and preference shareholders they invest in company's capital by purchase of its shares so when company makes profits company is required to pay amount of profit to these shareholders to preference shareholders fixed rate of dividend is given and to equity shareholders flexible rate of dividend is given the amount of profit which is not paid as dividend is transferred to reserves that is amount kept for future use for the company this ratio return on proprietors fund shows how much rate of income received by proprietors in relation to their amount invested this helps investors to decide whether to invest in particular company to withdraw investment from company to make more investment in that company so this is very important ratio let us understand its components formula and its significance this ratio measures the relationship between net profit after interest and tax and the proprietor's capital it is usually expressed as percentage it is also known as return on proprietor's equity or return on net worth return on proprietor's fund formula is net profit after tax divided by proprietor's fund multiplied by 100 component of the formula net profit after tax that is net profit after interest and tax proprietor's fund will consist of equity share capital add reserves and surplus less fictitious asset like miscellaneous expenses not written off or profit and loss account debit balance that is loss and we have to add preference share capital if there is any fresh capital introduced or capital redeemed at the end of the year it should be ignored the reason is that we are interested in knowing the total net worth employed during the year to earn the profits some analysts prefer to calculate average of proprietor's fund that is such funds at the beginning of the year and at the end of the year divided by 2 function purpose return on proprietor's fund is a profitability ratio which shows the relationship between profits and investment made by the proprietors in the concern its purpose is to measure the rate of return on capital funds made available to by the owners this ratio helps to judge how efficient concern is managing the owners fund at its disposal actual ratio its interpretation and comments actual ratio the actual return on proprietor's fund ratio x percent indicates that on each rupees 100 of proprietor's fund average net return of rupees x is on and this amount of x is available for appropriation for example return on proprietor's fund is 15% indicates that on each rupees 100 proprietor's fund net return of rupees 15 is on an amount of rupees 15 is available to take care of payment of dividend transfer to reserves and other appropriations actual ratio close to standard there is no standard return on proprietor's fund ratio in absolute terms each company has to determine its own standard ratio based on its past ratios ratios of other concerns in same industry and average for the entire industry an actual return on proprietors fund ratio close to such company standard shows an optimum profitability or 
each rupee of net worth that is sufficient returns available to take care of dividends reserves scope to attract fresh funds from the owners example issue of right shares actual ratio higher than the standard an actual return on proprietors fund ratio much higher than such company standard shows a very high profitability on each rupee of net worth that is very large returns available to take care of high dividends and large transfer to reserves great scope to attract large amount of fresh funds from the owners if industry standard is say 12% and companies proprietary fund we find a ratio of return is 18% that is higher than the standard definitely in such company more investment can be easily attracted actual ratio lower than the standard an actual return on proprietors fund ratio much lower than the such company standard shows a very low profitability on each rupee of investment made by the owners that is very small returns available which may not be enough to take care of dividends or make sufficient transfer to reserves therefore there is less scope to attract fresh funds from the owners interaction with the other ratios return on proprietors fund ratio should be studied with debt equity ratio to know the effect of capital structure on earnings of the proprietors debt equity ratio shows how much borrowed funds are used and how much own funds are used by the business out of total earnings first return to borrowed fund will be deducted and the balance will be available to owners fund therefore return on proprietors fund is studied with debt equity ratio let us understand return on proprietors fund ratio with the help of small example the following is a relevant extract from the profit and loss account and balance sheet of x limited as on 31st march 2014 profit and loss account for the year ended 31st march 2014 gross profit is given 2 lakhs administrative expenses 80000 selling and distribution expenses 27000 provision for taxation 13000 net profit carried down 80000 so amount of net profit shown by income statement profit and loss account is rupees 80000 balance sheet as on 31st march 2014 share capital 600 7% preference shares of rupees 100 each fully paid 60000 1500 equity shares of rupees 100 each fully paid 1 lakh 50000 total amount is 2 lakh 10000 this is total share capital 2 lakh 10000 reserves if we add general reserve 40000 capital redemption reserve 30000 dividend equalization fund 20000 so total reserves are 90000 so 2 lakh 10000 plus 90000 here we have total 3 lakhs net profit as per income statement rupees 80000 proprietors fund is equal to equity share capital plus reserves and surplus minus fictitious assets plus preference share capital equity share capital we have 1 lakh 50000 in reserves and surplus we have general reserve 40000 capital redemption reserve 
डिविडेंड इक्वेलाइजेशन फंड ट्वेंटी थाउजेंड प्लस प्रेफरेंस शेयर कैपिटल सिक्सटी थाउजेंड सो हियर वी हैव प्रोपराइटर्स फंड रुपीज थ्री लैक्स नेट प्रॉफिट अवेलेबल फॉर शेयर होल्डर्स रुपीज एटी थाउजेंड डिवाइडेड बाय प्रोपराइटर्स फंड थ्री लैक्स मल्टीप्लाइड बाय हंड्रेड सो प्रोपराइटर्स फंड रेशियो हियर वी गॉट ट्वेंटी सिक्स पॉइंट सिक्स सेवन परसेंट इन दिस वीडियो वी हैव अंडरस्टूड हाउ टू कैलकुलेट रिटर्न ऑन प्रोपराइटर्स फंड its significance and its relevance thanks for watching this video stay in tune with ikeda and subscribe to our channel ikeda thank you